Wake up! We're in the middle of a crisis. In the United States, over a hundred hate crimes against Asians are reported every day. During quarantine in Canada alone, domestic violence has increased by 30%. And after 30 years of rising living standards, the UN predicts 420 million people will plunge into extreme poverty. Is, Is one, one life, life worth, worth more, more than, than another? another? We're equally vulnerable, but unequally at risk. We, we must, must come, come together, together as a society to survive. Because alone we die. We're, We're in the middle of a crisis. crisis. The air filled with a virus and the cries of those affected echo against the pleas of the innocent blamed for its existence. We We're live in a, in a time, time of resistance, resistance to anything and anyone who isn't us. In the United States, another Vietnamese person is assaulted. A Korean mother harassed. Unwarranted, misdirected hatred because we can't even distinguish what we're supposed to fear. As if certain skin tones represent threats to our health. In China, doors are being shut in the face of the people of my race. Restaurants. Grocery stores. Hospitals where pregnant women are denied access due to the false idea that Africans carry the disease. While in the States, the script is flipped. In this sick game of finger pointing, we mindlessly play. We're in the middle, middle of, of a crisis, crisis trapped, trapped inside this quarantine. quarantine. This house is not a home. It's just another building where your demons feed. He pulls your hair, slaps your face. Everything hurts. You, you can't, can't leave. leave. You're trapped. The shelter you escaped to for safety and support closed its doors, sending people into the cruel street. You're, You're being, being sacrificed, sacrificed for the sake of social, social distancing. distancing. You have no choice but to stay home. Otherwise, you're exposed. But what's worse? Death by fate or by our lover's hand? We're, We're in, in the, the middle, middle of, of a crisis. crisis. Where odds are stacked in favor of the privileged, and, and for, for the rest, rest survival, survival is a gamble. gamble. Well, the economy quakes. It's overwhelming. How can anyone focus on anything like a radio dial where every channel is static and nothing makes sense anymore? Thoughts won't distance themselves in a cacophony of choices. What do you do when everything is uncertain? Families that clawed their way out of poverty begin to slip back in. They've picked themselves up by the bootstraps so many times. They've, They've snapped. snapped. Now they cling in desperation to governments who claim to put their citizens over profit. Yet corporate wealth increases to extremes at the price of workers' rights. For some, being laid off may mean sleeping on bus benches. While celebrities complain about being stuck in their mansion prisons. This, this is the survival, survival of, of the, the richest. richest. And we need to close the social distance. Fill the trench between the vulnerable front line and those who have managed to profit. How many times need we say, we're, we're in, in the, the middle, middle of a crisis. crisis? Should we keep hatred in our hearts in place of compassion at a time such as this? Our lives will continue, but, but for, for many, many, the distance between racism and equality remains the same. For, for many, many, the distance between poverty and security grows. For, for many, many, the distance between safety and death is closed. So, when this is all over, let's not go back to normal. Let's build a society where people don't have to run and hide. Where they can be safe with who they are on the inside. Let's, let's wake, wake up and, and build, build a, a new, new normal. normal. So we never go back to the way it was. There's no vaccine for intolerance. We'll have to wash our souls of prejudice. To, to keep, keep our, our conscience, conscience clean. clean.